So next we'll look at bipartite graphs. So we say a graph is bipartite if the vertices can be partitioned into two disjoint sets where every edge of the graph connects a vertex in the first set to a vertex in the second set. So for example, C6 is bipartite. You can see here I color-coded the vertices. So blue vertices are one set, red vertices are the second set, and every edge connects a blue vertex to a red vertex. This graph on the right is the exact same graph, C6, except for I just kind of redid it to where I kind of grew to my blue vertices and my red vertices together. And here you can see I easier that my edges go from the first set to the second set. K3, however, is not bipartite. So K3 has three vertices. And if I divide the vertex set into two disjoint sets, one of those sets must contain two vertices. And in a bipartite graph, vertices in the same set are not connected. So these two vertices could not be connected by an edge. But they are in K3, since K3 connects every pair of edges. So this graph is not bipartite. In general, we can say a graph is bipartite if and only if we can color each of the vertices one of two colors, such that no two adjacent vertices are the same color. So the idea is if we have a graph, we're going to pick a starting point. I'm going to pick this point here, and we're going to color it. Once we do that, we take all of its adjacent vertices and color them a different color. Now that we've done that, we'll take all of the vertices adjacent to these new red ones, and we're going to color them back to the first color, which is blue. And so, this is what we get. And now if you double check, all of your edges go between a blue and a red vertex. So therefore, is this graph bipartite? Yes, it is. Here I change the graph slightly. And once again, we're going to start with this top vertex. We'll color it blue. And we'll color all of its adjacent vertices red. We'll now color all of their adjacent vertices blue. So all of these vertices will need to be blue. And now we can see right here there's an edge that connects two blue vertices. So this graph is not bipartite. If you would have started at a different vertex than this one, your edge that causes the error may be in a different location. However, it will always show up if your graph is not bipartite. So we can also have a complete bipartite graph. This is a graph that is partitioned into two subsets of M and N vertices. An edge connects two vertices if and only if one vertex is in the first subset and the other vertex is in the second subset. So for instance here, this is K5, 4, because I have five vertices on the top, four vertices on the bottom, and every edge connects vertices from the first set to the second set. And in particular, every vertex at the top is connected to every vertex in the bottom set. 